rich horse racing history could be expanding in Harford County. The state is eyeing a Harford County location for a new thoroughbred training facility. County leaders are all in support of the proposed project, and so are members of the community where the facility could be built. Jessica Albert on your corner tonight in Perryman. She explains what the state could be planning and why the community is really pushing for this project. The state is considering several areas across Maryland for its new thoroughbred training facility. People in Perryman are hoping that the state will select their community to help preserve the history of it. This farmland in the Perryman community is one of the state's top choices for the new facility. The state's plan for the space includes two training tracks, 640 stalls, and an equine wellness research center on 97 acres of this land. We think there's a lot of value left in this in this area, and we want. To try to take advantage of that. Glenn Gillis is a member of a group called Protect Perryman Peninsula, also known as 3P. Over the last three years, 3P has been fighting to stop a plan to build 5.2 million square feet of warehouse space on this farmland. The group would rather see a state park built in the space. They're hopeful they're one step closer to their goal now that the state is interested in the land for the training center. We're very encouraged by the heritage uh, that this this um, thoroughbred racing facility would be um, would be supporting. Um, it would go along very nicely with um, with this rural community's um, character. County leaders are also throwing their support behind the project. Last week, County Executive Bob Cassily sent a letter of support to the state, and the county council unanimously passed a resolution in support of the proposed project. I'm excited to see this happen. I'm hopeful that we can see it happen and. By passing this resolution, we can let the state know that Harford County government stands in unison in support of, uh, of this possibility. We did reach out to the state to try to learn more about when a location will be selected and when construction will begin on the project. We are waiting to hear back. Reporting in Harford County, Jessica Alpert for WJZ. Thank you, Jessica. And if you know of a story in Harford County, reach out to community reporter Jessica Albert. She's on your corner and in your corner covering stories in that county. Email newsroom at wjz.com with your information.